I don't remember. I think that house might have opened just recently or something, because I would have went into it if it hadn't. So, let's see where... Ah, yes! I remember. Way up here is the, um... The Crescent Moon Dagger thing. Oh, and here's Fleshlight. Still being a saint of the flesh. I think we've been to every one of these houses. Wait, 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 wait. There's this one. Nope. Yep, this one. I don't recall this one being opened. Let's see what's in here. Pretty sure I haven't been in this house because the door should be wide opened if I had been. So let's look around. Yeah, there's tentacles coming out of the toilet. Somebody took a nasty shit. Damn. <laughs> Another m messy bed. Now that's a view. Look at that. That is one interesting view. Ooh, I can go over here now. Ooh, I wonder what's over here. Oh, nice! Got another one of those creepy uh, statues. Another collectible in the game. Need to jump. There we go. Jump. There we go. Made it. Let's see if I can find that house that has the uh, crescent moon. I think it's this one. If I'm not mistaken, this is the house that I need to get to. The sound of the squishing and the nastiness of those tentacles is kind of uh, gross. Yeah, it's definitely kind of gross. Yep, here it is. We found it. Excellent. Now we can use the crescent moon dagger. And see what happens. Here we go. Oh shit. Let us explore this new spooky tunnel. See where it leads us. Shit, I know where this is. This is from that cutscene where he beats the fuck out of that, uh, uh, retarded, disfigured kid. Their son, basically. And this was from the cutscene that we just saw where he absolutely penetrated that woman. Real deep. He shoved it so deep inside her. It was just... Oh. That was... That was... That was... That was nasty. <laughs> oh shit. This looks like an area we haven't been to yet. Man, look at this. That's barbed wire, too. These almost look like crosses or something. Like makeshift crosses. Like, look at that. It's like they're covered in barbed wire, too. Damn. This is one fucked up area. There's an axe on the wooden logs. Ooh. Nice. Another piece. Look at that. We found another piece of those uh, stone things. I have no idea what they are, but uh, 
I'm pretty sure they go to that gigantic ass door. That blocks our way to the tower, I'm assuming, over there. So this is piece number three. We just need the final piece. No, no, wait. Do we have all the pieces? I'm trying to think. Wait, that's two. That's three. We're missing one piece. I wonder where that final piece is. It's probably in one of the houses somewhere. I wouldn't be surprised if it's just sitting in a village somewhere. Wait, 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 wait. Let me take this back. Just in case. You never know. Alright, let's look around. Let's go back to the village and see if there's any doors that I missed. Because this tentacle stuff might have opened up another path or something. We have three of the four stone pieces. And we need to see if there's any doors that got knocked open by the slimy tentacle stuff. Ew, it's everywhere. Let's look around here. Nope, can't go that way. Did I check this house? I think I did. Or did I? It looks different. I'm sure I did, yes. Yes, 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 I did. These houses kind of look the same. Kind of hard to figure out which house is which. Let's see, any other houses that look like I haven't checked them yet? I checked this house. There's nothing here. Nothing in the bathroom. Always gotta check the toilet. Make sure somebody didn't leave a dookie in the toilet. You never know. See over here, what's over here? Did I go in here? I think I did. Wait, is this the same? This is the same house. They all look the same. I literally can't tell the difference between these houses. They all look identical to each other. Oh shit, here's one. This is different. I think we found it. Yep, there it is. Nice. The final piece. I knew it. The tentacles basically break open the doors so that the doors are slightly ajar. Because I totally would have explored those houses had they been, you know, openable in the first place. So the fact that they weren't means that they are new. So let's go and put these things into the uh, gigantic ass door. Because we have every single piece now. Let's go and do this. I'm excited. Oh, what the fuck? Well. The entire village just like... Disappeared. Just crumbled away. That's not good. Well, there's no going back now. <laughs> I guess we only keep going forward. We shall press on to that creepy ass tower in the distance. Everything in this place is falling apart. What the fuck? Everything in this place is falling apart. Where do I get the feeling I'm going to fall apart with these buildings and areas? Well, we're extremely limited on where to go now, so it's straight on to this door. 
There's the moon. There's the sun. Oh, let's see what piece works with this. This one? Oh, nice. Uh, what about... Nope. This one? Nope. This one? There we go. Oh, that's a piece of fire. So that one's a goblet. That one's fire. And this one is... A heart! What is the last one? Skull, I bet. Looked like a skull when I picked it up. Yep. Oh shit, look at that. What is this? Daggers. I bet it's the daggers. Yep. What an intricate door lock. Oh shit! It's opening! My god. Look at this. What an intricate door, right? That's crazy. Well, onto the tower we go. I wonder if that place is gonna fall away. This is definitely hell. Climbing our way to the top. No oh shit, another spooky little altar. Yeah, I know, uh, real haze. Oh shit, what's going on? Oh fuck, it did. It did disappear. But yeah, Real Haze, this is lots of puzzles. This episode has been, uh... This... This chapter has been, like... Mostly puzzles. More than anything else. Oh, shit, what the fuck is this? Those are bones. Oh my god, look at them. I'm walking on a field of bones. Look at this. These bones stretch on for miles. It's a fucking field of bones. Look how far they go. Holy shit. How many people would this be? Like, half the world's population. This is fucking disturbing. Listen to the crunching under my feet. My god, look at this. It's just like everywhere. Well, looks like we're going to this ominous tower. Oh shit. Well, here we go. Into the tower. I'm guessing we're going after Juan now. We went after his kid, we went after his wife, and now it's after him. Saint of the flesh, satisfy our hunger from your crimson depths. Let your blood enlighten us. Nourish and feed us with your perennial wisdom through the flesh of the blessed ones. guessing that's the prayer to him or something. Whoa, look at this place. Damn. Look at this place. Just like caked up blood in there or something. Why do I get the feeling that these are going to be filled up with blood? These little moat areas here. 
I get this strange feeling it's like this is like some kind of sacrificial temple of some kind and all these areas are just going to be filled up with like blood or something look at this place see there's like drains and stuff everywhere Oh, hi there. What the fuck? This is an interesting statue. <laughs> Was that a monkey? Those are either people or monkeys. Well, let's look around. Let's see what this door has. Oh! This looks like a church or something. Oh, and it has... It has these little moats, too. Yeah, this is like some kind of demon worshipping cult. Thought I saw something. What is in here? down there. Oh shit. Found a key. Bet we're gonna find the door that the key unlocks very soon. still say those look like monkeys. These statues are creepy. They're like just heads with like teeth. They have no face. It's just teeth. Their heads are made of teeth. What the fuck? Ooh, nice. Another note. Most survivors had their psyche destroyed. It was not a plague, but a devastating syndrome of abstinence capable of atrophying the cerebral cortex in an irreversible way. But this man had a soft mental pulse, which was just enough to let me in. He was a kind of prisoner who had been immobilized by cutting part of their arms to then be cast into oblivion. I used all my capacity, and with a great effort I managed to go through his life as if I were fast-forwarding some movie. The obscene images crushed me, and in a reflex action I had to disconnect from that mind, escaping from the remainder of that memory. But why did I do that? Why did I abandon such an... <laughs> interesting mind? Why did he abandon it? That laugh at the end, though. I think he might be going crazy. Let's see what's in here. Oh, goody. 
There's a goblet. What is this? This is definitely some kind of worshipping temple. Oh, this door's locked. Looks like we got a key. So now we can get here. Let's just make sure we've explored everything here first. Look at this. Intricate doors. Looks like they won't open yet. We need to do something first. Look at all these little moat indentations on the floor. I swear something's going to be flowing through here. I wouldn't be surprised if it's blood. If you think about it, because it's flesh, you know, they say he's a flesh god or something. And then they're talking about sacrifices and cannibalism and shit like that. I wouldn't be surprised. Wow, look at that. What the fuck? What in the hell is that? I'm assuming I'm going down this. Looks like a funnel of some kind. Oh shit. Well, this isn't good. This isn't good at all. What in the fuck is this? Listen to that screaming. What the fuck is this? Something nasty. I have no clue what this is. Looks like a huge cauldron or something. The fuck? There's something down there. I can't see it, though. Look how big this is. Holy shit. Look at the... Look at how huge this container is. Or cauldron, or whatever it is. Oh. This is not gross at all. Ew. It's like I'm going inside someone's anus now. This is not at all disgusting. It's like blood water. What is that? Is that bones? Looks like a bunch of bones. If that's bones, then holy shit. Ah! Ew, it's not bones, it's fucking bodies. It's a fucking container. A cauldron full of bodies. My god, this is... Some fucked up shit. It's a huge, gigantic... Gigantic container. Ew, there's a brain over there, and a brain up there too. That is nasty. It's like a whole bunch of dead bodies all got thrown into this... Container. This is some seriously... Ew, I'm in blood water now. Ew. Get to the surface. Ew. 
And there's meaty chunks down there, too. There's, like, pieces of someone's body. Ew, there's... Man, this is disgusting. <laughs> I know, right? Well, they really made this quite um, gory, that's for sure. And it's even crazier that there's like that huge, huge container full of like, I don't know, thousands upon thousands of dead bodies. And it looks like I'm going in here. Ew. Imagine submerging yourself in this water, this bloody goo water. I would be traumatized if I had to swim through this shit. Get out. How do I get out? Let me out. There we go. Let's see what's through this door. What the fuck? It goes from stone to... No oh, shit. Can I go back? Nope. It just went from like medieval stone to like urban laboratory complex style of decor. Now all of a sudden there's like a hundred pipes everywhere. What the fuck is that? There's the screaming again. <laughs> Look at that thing. It's a fucking... What is it? A grinder? a fucking meat grinder and the container up there all those dead bodies wow they have a gigantic facility dedicated to grinding up thousands upon thousands upon thousands upon thousands of corpses more live people I have no idea maybe they were live when they were thrown in there and they died while they were smothered this is fucking crazy did they think i was going to be surprised my source of pleasure the one i used to destroy everything that did not deserve to exist for me that is everything doorways was did they think they could use me as a cleaning tool to wrap up their mess did they think I bought their lies? An organization in favor of justice. Please. I have always known their true motives and intentions. Doorways is used to get rid of everything no longer useful. I knew what they were planning. I knew this was my last commission. The moment to leave had come. Oh shit, we learned the truth about Doorways. Doorways is not a secret organization that sends agents into psychopaths' brains or minds in order to bring them to justice. In truth, it's a way of getting rid of people. <laughs> 